Hello and welcome to the Canadian Animal Health Surveillance System website at cas.ca. In this quick video, I'll guide you through on how to access a CAS regulated disease table, which allows the users to determine whether a terrestrial or aquatic disease of interest is reportable or notifiably nationally and within different provinces and territories in Canada. Before exploring our website, make sure you have the correct language selected to navigate the website. This is located on the top right hand corner. EN will take you to the CAS pages in English, whereas FR will take you to the CAS pages in French. If you hover over to CAS tools, you'll be able to click on a reportable and notifiable disease table. The light blue box includes a legend with acronyms and what they stand for in terms of their regulatory codes. For example, R is reportable, N is notifiable, IN is immediately notifiable, and so on. There are a few ways to use this table. You can either search by the disease name, region, or animal type. Regions that are not on the table do not publish a list of regulated diseases. For example, if I'm interested in finding more information about rabies and how it's regulated across different jurisdictions, I could type in rabies in the text box that says all terrestrial animal diseases. As you can see here, rabies is reportable with the CFIA, notifiable with Alberta, reportable in British Columbia, Manitoba, Newfoundland, Quebec, Saskatchewan, and immediately notifiable in Ontario. Before looking at another disease, you should press the navy button to clear your options. You can also look up the type of regulated disease based on classification and region. For example, if I'm interested in finding more about reportable diseases in British Columbia, I can type an R inside the text box that says code in the BC column. Here, you can see that the column for BC is now highlighted blue with all the reportable diseases, from African horse sickness, to BSE, to EEE, and more. If you scroll back up and look at anthrax, you'll see that it's reportable in BC, but only notifiable in Alberta. Another way to use the table is to find the disease by species. If you are interested in looking at finfish disease and how they are regulated, you can simply click on the tab that says finfish. You'll find all the diseases listed here and their classification codes nationally and across provinces and territories. Be aware that diseases affecting finfish, crustaceans, mollusks, and amphibians are not present in the all terrestrial animal diseases category. And as such, when searching for a disease affecting these species, the relevant category should be selected before entering the disease name in the search bar. You can find links to regulated disease lists and other reference documents published by federal and provincial governments if you click on the website link. That's it for now. We hope you enjoyed watching this short video. If you have any questions on how to navigate our regulated disease table, or if you have any comments or questions on the classification of any diseases, please email casinfo at ahwcouncil.ca. Tune in to our other videos as we show you how to use our other CAS tools. Bye for now! Funding for CAS activities has been provided through the Agri-Assurance Program under the Canadian Agricultural Partnership, a federal-provincial territorial initiative.